Have you ever wondered why we sleep? The question is not as simple as it might seem. For a long time, we've held a belief that sleep is a luxury, a privilege belonging to the complex creatures of the world, those with intricate and elaborate nervous systems. The mammals, the birds, the reptiles, and more recently, even fish are known to sleep. Ants, despite their minuscule size, are considered complex due to their sophisticated social behaviors and brain complexity, and yes, they too sleep. This traditional view has often led us to associate sleep with brain function. The brain, after all, is the command center of our bodies, controlling everything from our heartbeat to our thoughts. It seems only logical that it would need to rest, to recharge, to refresh. And for this, we thought sleep was its sanctuary. But what if we told you that this belief is not entirely accurate? Enter the humble jellyfish, a primitive organism with no central nervous system. In 2017, researchers from the California Institute of Technology and the Howard Hughes Medical Institute published a study in the journal Current Biology, revealing that these upside-down jellyfish enter states remarkably similar to sleep. This was a groundbreaking discovery that challenged our understanding of sleep, hinting at a more fundamental biological purpose. Then, in 2020, Kyushu University in Japan found similar sleep behaviours in another simple organism, the hydra. This reinforced the notion that sleep could be a widespread evolutionarily ancient trait, not just a feature evolved for brain rest in higher animals. So, could it be that sleep is not just for the brainy creatures? Could it be that sleep in its most primitive form, is a basic biological function, as essential as eating or breathing. It's a tantalizing thought, isn't it? However, recent research has begun to challenge this belief, revealing that the story of sleep might be far more fascinating than we ever imagined. In 2017, a study made an astonishing discovery. Jellyfish, creatures without a brain, exhibit sleep-like states. Imagine that. These gelatinous beings, drifting effortlessly through the ocean, do not just float aimlessly when the lights go out. They engage in a state that eerily resembles what we know as sleep. This groundbreaking study, conducted by the California Institute of Technology and the Howard Hughes Medical Institute, turned our understanding of sleep on its head. It challenged the long-held belief that sleep was exclusive to organisms with complex nervous systems. You see, for the longest time, we thought that sleep was a luxury afforded only to the likes of mammals, birds, reptiles, and even fish. The idea of a jellyfish needing 40 winks seemed preposterous. Yet here we are. Jellyfish, these primitive organisms devoid of a central nervous system, engage in sleep-like behaviors. This discovery nudges us to consider that sleep might be serving a more fundamental biological purpose than we previously thought. Could it be that sleep isn't just for rest and recovery of the brain, as we've been led to believe? Fast forward to 2020, and another study, this time by Kyushu University in Japan, strengthened this line of thinking. They found sleep behaviors in the hydra, another simple organism. This finding reinforces the notion that sleep could be a widespread evolutionary ancient trait. So what does all this mean? Well, the implications are far reaching. If sleep is not just for brain rest, but a basic biological function, it forces us to rethink our understanding of sleep's role in survival and adaptation. It also opens up discussions on the evolutionary pressures that have shaped sleep behaviors across the animal kingdom. The idea that wakefulness, not sleep, might be the adaptation is an intriguing one. Could it be that the ability to stay awake and active evolved as a survival mechanism, possibly in response to threats or the need for food and reproduction? This revelation prompts us to reconsider our understanding of sleep and its origins. As we delve deeper into the surprising truth about sleep, one thing is clear. Sleep, as ubiquitous as it is mysterious, continues to challenge and fascinate us. If sleep is not just for brain rest, what could be its purpose? Could it be an evolutionary trait the answer might surprise you. The discovery of sleep in jellyfish sparked more research into this fascinating phenomenon. In 2020, scientists from Kyushu University in Japan stumbled upon a similar sleep behavior in Hydra, a simple organism related to jellyfish. These tiny freshwater creatures, despite lacking a centralized nervous system, 
exhibited clear signs of sleep. The hydra would retract their tentacles and remain motionless for several hours, a behavior strikingly similar to sleep. This discovery raised the possibility that sleep could be a widespread evolutionary ancient trait, not just a behavior evolved for brain rest. This notion challenges our understanding of sleep. The fact that primitive organisms like hydra and jellyfish engage in sleep-like behaviours suggests that sleep might serve a more fundamental biological purpose. Could it be that sleep is the default state of all living organisms and wakefulness is the adaptation? This hypothesis proposes that the ability to stay awake and active might have evolved as a survival mechanism. Think about it. Being awake could help an organism respond to threats seek food, or reproduce. In essence, wakefulness could be an evolutionary response to environmental challenges. But it's not just about survival, it's also about balance. Both excessive sleep and lack of sleep can have detrimental effects on health, suggesting a balanced need for sleep in maintaining optimal physiological and psychological states. Consider the giant sequoia, a tree that has evolved to resist fire. This remarkable adaptation underscores the complexity of evolution and the interconnectedness of all living things, including the role of sleep in that web of life. These discoveries reshape our understanding of sleep, suggesting it might represent the original state of living organisms. If that's the case, then sleep isn't just a necessity for us higher organisms. It's a fundamental part of life, as ancient as life itself. Could the ability to stay awake be a survival mechanism that evolved in response to environmental pressures? This question has sparked intriguing discussions in the scientific community. Our exploration of sleep across the animal kingdom reveals a fascinating hypothesis. Perhaps it wasn't sleep that evolved, but wakefulness. This idea flips our conventional understanding upside down, suggesting that the original state of living organisms might have been a perpetual sleep-like state Wakefulness then could be a later adaptation, a survival mechanism that emerged in response to environmental challenges. Imagine the earliest organisms in the primordial soup of life. For them, being awake might have been a luxury, a state that consumed precious energy. As evolution marched on, the ability to remain alert and active could have evolved as a response to threats or the need for food and reproduction. Over time, Wakefulness might have become a critical survival strategy, shaping the sleep patterns we observe in various species today. Now, let's take a detour from the animal kingdom and consider the world of plants, a realm where survival strategies are equally diverse and fascinating. Consider the giant sequoia, one of the world's oldest and largest living organisms. These towering trees have developed a unique adaptation to resist forest fires, a common threat in their native habitats. Their thick, fibrous bark acts as a natural fire-resistant shield, allowing them to survive and thrive in environments where other plants would perish. This example serves to highlight the complexity and diversity of survival strategies across life on Earth. It's a testament to the power of adaptation and the relentless drive of life to endure against all odds. In the same way, the evolution of sleep and wakefulness might be a testament to the adaptability of living organisms, a story of survival written in the language of biology. This perspective invites us to appreciate the intricate web of life, where even sleep plays a critical role. It's a reminder that everything is interconnected, that every organism, every behavior, every adaptation has a place in the grand tapestry of life. So, what is the surprising truth about sleep across the animal kingdom? Well, it turns out that sleep is not just a restful state for the brain in complex organisms, but a fundamental biological function that has endured the test of evolutionary time. This universal phenomenon, observed even in primitive life forms like jellyfish and hydra, has been instrumental in shaping the survival strategies and adaptive behaviors of countless species. The presence of sleep in these simple organisms challenges our traditional understanding of sleep as a complex neurological process. Instead, it suggests that sleep might have been the original state of living organisms, with wakefulness evolving later as an adaptation to environmental pressures. The ability to stay awake, to hunt for food or evade predators, might have been a survival mechanism that emerged in response to these pressures. 
But the story of sleep doesn't end there. Just as sleep is essential for survival, it's also critical for maintaining optimal health and well-being. Both excessive sleep and the lack of it can have detrimental effects on an organism's health. This suggests a balanced need for sleep, hinting at its role in regulating physiological and psychological states. Even in the plant kingdom, we see unique survival strategies. Take the giant sequoia's ability to resist fire, for instance. This adaptation reminds us of the myriad ways life on Earth has evolved to thrive in diverse environments. And in this grand tapestry of life, sleep, as it turns out, plays a critical role. As we delve deeper into the world of sleep, we begin to see its universal nature and its profound impact on the evolutionary history of life on Earth. Every new discovery, every surprising truth, brings us one step closer to understanding the fundamental nature of sleep and its role in our lives. As we continue to uncover the mysteries of sleep, we are reminded of how interconnected all life on Earth truly is. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey into the world of sleep.